for some people, organized religion is not very appealing. That's why one man in the valley has found a way to spread the word in a very unusual way. Cronkite News reporter Maxine Park takes us to the drive through prayer stand. On most mornings as commuters head to work in Queen Creek, you can find Matthew Cordell on the side of the road. And we thank you for the blessings of the future, God. Praying. Precious name we pray. Amen. I saw a fruit stand on the side of the road and God told me make a prayer stand. Matthew runs his drive through prayer stand three days a week from 6 to 10 a.m. Ready to pray with anyone who stops by. Spiritual, mental, physical, you know, financial. We're just out here to pray with people about whatever their needs are. At most drive throughs people are picking up fast food. But at this drive through they're getting something a little different, an order of faith with a little bit of hope. For people that don't feel comfortable going into a church or something, uh, they can just stop by. The location varies, but on this morning, his team is at the corner of Bella Vista and Gansell. His faithful companion, Sky, is there too. I feel like I'm, a, I'm the tool, but it's always going to be God making the connection. But patrons say his stand means so much more. Willing to go ahead and pray. Judgment. By setting up a drive through you're saying two seconds. Give God that, that much time. But Matthew says he's just here to listen and help people find their faith in times of need. By being out here and being available to pray with them, I think I'm just kind of giving that bridge so that they can find a way back. A modern day disciple trying to spread the word one drive through at a time. In Queen Creek, Maxine Park, Cronkite News. And if you'd like more information on Matthew's prayer stand, go to prayerstandministries.org.